Hey my friends, another treat. You just saw me up hanging out and partying with the Harley Club and the folks here, but I am meeting the one only uh, man, the Harley technician here in Ghana. Uh, introduce yourself, my friend. Hi, how are you? This is Makram speaking. Have you hit that subscribe button, that notification bell? You're gonna be missing out on videos and free prizes and raffles we have coming up. Actually, I'm the master tech of Harley Davidson here in Accra. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Got it. Got it. And, and we are going to get to see your shop that you're building. Absolutely. That's the workshop here where we do all types of service and maintenance and troubleshooting. Shit. It's an authorized Harley Davidson workshop. Oh, where man, this the, is great. Look, you're even got your exhaust system. You're not messing around. Yes. Look up here to the tools, hand tools. Dude, I'm impressed. <laughs> Another lift, little oil service station. Yes. Actually, today we're drinking because we are not working, huh? Right, so, yeah, yeah. Everybody's... It's an off day hey, now. Hey, thanks for we letting... Are uh, with the guys. Thanks for letting Hot Wrench come in and see your place and meet all your friends, man. Thank you very much for your Oh, coming. this is cool. Well, here's the deal. I met Aldis mm -hmm. and did a video for him in his shop, and he said, you've got to meet my technician. That guy is super uh, impressed with your work, and he really talked well about you. Thank you very much yeah. for him and for all the Dude, guys. Dude, this is something no one has in America... This, I'm I'm a little bit blown away right now by your press because what no one has is the safety cage. Yes. You know what I mean? No one has it. I don't even use mine too much, but this I, is badass. Can I touch this? Sure, sure. So what I love about this, if you've all seen my videos on uh, on how to wrench, is the adjustability here where you can just move the head of this around and get it where you want. This is one of the coolest little 20-ton presses I've seen, but I love... The safety cage. Oh, you got a foot operated pump too. Absolutely. A little drill press, a little grinder, got some cleaners, some oils, nice little part solvent. Ooh, even the balance dynamic balancing. Wow. What are we doing here? Well, here we have to go for some uh, an, uh, customization for the turn signal this time sure. on this one, this Coastal 883 item. Okay, and uh, we've been doing some jobs on it, not that much. Some people they do it and they get it back again here to do all the wiring and the, to, to make the job a proper, it has how, how it has to be done. Yeah. So this is really cool how you chopped all this up. Yeah, but yeah, uh, when, is this a custom made plate then? Because yeah, I haven't seen any the small. Is, the, thing is, the thing is with all customization that they do in this bike, it's nice to have a look at it. But if you want to ride it when it's like mud or rain or something, sure. it's not the right bike to go with. But right. I keep saying, the main important, when you have to get your bike, you have to know what purpose you need it for. Because the bike that you have to cross country with it, it's never going to be the same bike that you go and it has to be look nice on the bike show. It always has to be have a lot of difference on the way of customization. Dude, this is so cool. It's clean too. Yes. It's clean and organized. You must know that this workshop has been worked on it for three years, huh? This tools here. <laughs> From the drawers. You got all your snacks lined absolutely. up from Aldis. Yes, yeah. absolutely. Let's look in your toolbox. Yes. In a toolbox, this is a three oh. years old toolbox. Shadow box. Yes. Freaking awesome. For me, for whoever wants to do any workshop and work on any workshop, he must first thing pay for this shadow boxes yep. before when he pay for the tools. Yep. Because these ones which will let you know at the end of the day if there is any one of your babies are missing. I'm gonna tell you a fun story because my viewers will probably appreciate that. Do you know where this comes from? What yes. industry? Uh, no, it's it's best which is like here. This is the, it's a uh, kids' tools. Well, I mean, I mean the idea. The idea. The idea of shadow boxing your tools. Uh huh. Comes Ooh. from aviation. Uh huh. And the story I heard is way back in the day of early avionics, where technicians would work on planes. Yes. A pilot would go up like in an F-16, and yes. a 9 16th wrench would hit him in the head. Absolutely. And they'd be like, "What?" And they'd be masked. And so they started thinking about like, "Hey, we need to inventory our tools." Mm -hmm. And then what I heard happened in aviation eventually is that when the service manager would come into the shop, I did this at my college. Yeah. I shadow boxed all the tools. Yes. And at the end of the day, I didn't go look uh, on workbenches and go look for tools. I went to the toolbox and went, look. oh, you know, this let's is look. missing. Let's All right, who's got that? Let's go and find it. And then it. I had a checkout sheet with everybody's name. And, and if they wanted to grab a tool out of the toolbox, not wrenches, but like specialty <laughs> tools, Special tools yes. their name would be on here. I didn't even have to walk. Absolutely. I could go right to the tool, to the guy who see who borrowed it. Hey, 
Bring back the tools. Absolutely. But I learned that from aviation. I thought that was a cool story. Mm, so yes. my YouTube fans on here, uh, having a little fun here. Oh, see some diagnostic equipment. Yes. And you a, said that you have HD. Uh, uh, this is a DH, uh, this is a digital technician. Digital technician. Yeah, I couldn't think, couldn't yes. think of the name. Wow. Because as I'm telling you, we are an authorized workshop here. We are right. a map and a bike shop. What do we? What's going on here? This what do we, is emergency for... kill. Oh, shut up. That is fantastic. It's all through the ground and back through there. I'm back to the ground again. Did you build this? No, it's coming as a this, set from... Uh... From this company? Wow. Oh, even an air clamp. Yes. Man, this is no joke. Absolutely. This is no joke. Which model meter? Here, 789. Yes. And this is up to date. Wow. Hey, my friends. I love it, seeing manuals, seeing all the right stuff. If you are in Accra or Ghana and you need the best certified technician out there and possibly the only one, here's your man right and there. I do, also do you got a business you, card I can flash in here or anything? Uh, it's in my car. Even in uh, west of uh, Africa, I'm doing the bikes in uh, Cape Coast, uh, sorry, in uh, Abidjan, okay. Togo. Whatever, whenever my customers are calling me, we are planning for how we're going to make it. If they want a brand new bike, if they want a used bike, if they want any uh, maintenance or service, you just pop it up, we just be in call, we check what they want. If emergency that need me to be there, I have to fly. That's what I do with all, most of my customers in Abidjan. Okay. I have a very good, cool guys there. We've okay. been dealing with them now for like two years. Well, here's what I want you to do. I want you to make sure Aldis gets me your contact information. I will flash that in the bottom of the screen and in the content. Absolutely. And you all have your hookup. Now, I am so excited to meet you, my friend. As you all time. say, welcome to Africa. Absolutely. <laughs> we are here in Africa. We are not in a different planet. We are still in the same planet. And we got to make the things right to enjoy our life. Being important of what we are doing here, to go safe to where we want to go in our motorcycle and come back safe to our serious life. I'm here all week. Aldous is letting me borrow his bike. We should go ride. Absolutely. All right, my friend. The police bike up there is mine. Oh, yeah. I saw two police bikes up there. I was like, I took a bunch of photos. The one with the speaker uh, is mine. That's yours? With the white? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I pay attention. I pay attention. Hey, my friend, thank you for the tour. I can't wait to see you done. They're actually building a really cool... Uh, cafe, hangout, little club here. This is going to be a really neat place to uh, come when I come uh, visit Accra here, which uh, I'll be doing a fair amount for zip lines. So this is pretty awesome. Do you mind if we go inside and look? <laughs> yeah, might as well just show you. This is pretty stinking cool. Cooking out, having a good time, checking out the rest of the bikes. If you didn't see part one of this video, hit up part one. And uh, oh, he's got to get his food. <laughs> Gotta eat. Let's see. Let's. We're gonna sneak through here. Oh. Oh, this is gonna be cool. This is gonna be cool. Is gonna be the bike of what? So they can come get the oil change, get some food and drink, and do both. You can get pool tables, some games or something maybe. And look at this view. We're right by the airport. Yeah. Uh, this is a pretty neat area. The mall's over here, a little shopping district. Uh, oh, this is just going to be cool. Man, this is going to be neat. Well, hey, my friend, it was good to meet you. I'm super excited to uh, just meet some motorcyclists. Here. What's in here? It's going to be the secret lounge. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Here, all this area to be a secret lounge oh, wow, for yeah. people to come and chill. Yeah, and you're just gonna whoa! You're just gonna grow this market. You said that you know your big plan is to grow the Harley market here in Accra. <laughs> like a Fat Boy wheel, mm -hmm. some Van Shine's oh, exhaust system. boxes. Mm. With the number of the shelf, so we're gonna put them on the shelf, so you can see if we want that. All the new boxes. You're new you're impressed, my friend. I'm mm -hmm. impressed. Nice. I'll say it. Nice. I will say it. All right, I'm going to check out because I want to keep going and hanging out with this group. But hey, my friends, if you haven't done so, make sure and like, share, subscribe. I'll put, like I said, all the contact. You got social medias, Facebook, Instagram, any of that stuff. So uh, we'll put those links below. But follow our friends, 
support the business, make it a great day. And as I say it, uh, at how to wrench all the time, keep wrenching my friend. Thank you very much as usual. Cheers. <laughs>